Hi everybody. So I'm back today with an updated review for the pumpkin pie from Mark Lobliner. And I'm very, very sad to say I still fucking hate it. I hate it so bad. I can't freaking do this shit. This one here. The, the, the pumpkin pie. Please. It's not for everybody. Um, don't buy it if you can't get a sample from it. Because I really, really gave it a try. I was using it for about 2-3 weeks now. Hoping to like it. And I didn't. And trust me, I love everything pumpkin. Everything pumpkin. Pumpkin lattes, pumpkin pies, pumpkin muffins, pumpkin cupcakes. Everything that has pumpkin in it. Love it. This, hate it. Um, because I really couldn't really drink it around the house. I'm like, forget about it. I'm going to drink it in the gym. Right while I work out for some nutrition, you know, feed the muscle. But uh, what started happening was that I just wanted to puke. I drink this. I'm thirsty. I drink it. And then my stomach starts turning. And I just can't. So I feel like I just wasted about 55 plus shipping down the drain because I can't stomach this thing. I wish I can go exchange it, but I can't. So all I'm saying is don't be like me. Don't dump your money down the drain. Don't buy a five pound jar of protein powder that you don't know if you're going to like or not. I really wanted to like it. I do enjoy the, the cookies and cream. I enjoy the chocolate and the red velvet. But I couldn't do this. And since we are out, out of red velvet. And out of chocolate. And I'm waiting for them to arrive in mail. I had to stop at GNC and get myself Dimatize Isoway chocolate. So it can get me through the days while I'm waiting for the other ones to arrive. Because this... It's not gonna cut it so yeah be careful and if somebody else has it at their house try it like that first just don't go doing that I always stick with chocolate it's the safest choice nobody can get chocolate wrong so that's how I see it so I hope this helps somebody see you next time